Hello guys and girls, we are here expanding your consciousness, giving you the best life advice and exposing the matrix. In this video we're gonna talk about why spiritual awakening feels like you are dying, why why the, the raising in consciousness feels like shit. Your spiritual awakening is getting triggered. You wake up to a new world and you experience this blissful phase that is most of the times in the beginning. Uh, I observed a lot of people um, from my experience. My experience, it happened on the beginning. There was like seven to ten days. Oh my God. And then your uh, body, because it, it cannot anchor uh, this uh, energy, be this energy begins to subside. When when we go f for me, actually for me, I went directly into another dark night of the soul. After that, when we when we go through our expansion of consciousness, we sometimes feel like we caught up in this never ending story of uh, you know of feeling like uh, we are dying when uh, when this intense energy frequency shifts we experience you know frustration exhaustion uh, exhaustion fear everything comes up to be released okay and uh, th this is super uncomfortable. In uh, in an essence, it's like you are dying. You are actually sending away everything that is of the old self. Shifting frequency on a higher, you know, on an energy level happens instantly. Okay. And th this is the shift to another dimension. This is. Spiritual awakening, okay, this is the spiritual awakening trigger. Shift to another dimension, it happens instantly. Something has changed inside you. Okay, you see different, you feel different, you experience different. The medal, the emotional and the physical body has to come along, has to follow that. Okay, and uh, change on the 3D, 4D reality is slower. Okay, the the, phys the change in the physical body is slower, and um, it takes time. The metal and the physical body has to adjust. They have to adjust. So what happens right there? It's time we go th through such a trigger. You are releasing the old patterns you are releasing the, the old belief systems you are releasing everything that does not fit the new level okay and uh, every old fear frequency that we hold inside our body inside our memory inside our body memory in our cellular cellular memory steps up to be released they show up in the forms of the emotion we feel uh, they show up into physical pain uh, your whole body is talking to you actually the, the, the whole body is speaking to you I see my body at this moment I see my body you know there is a memory inside my mind but there is a a cellular memory inside every part of my body this part thinks feels you know it speaks to me it speaks to me every single cell of my body is speaking to me right now everything is coming up to be changed okay and uh, this is super uncomfortable we, we feel the old pain we dive we dive deep in every memory inside our brain and we change it we change the energy we, we remove the fear and we let it go and we, we go deep and every energy transmutation we do 
in our brain f- first all this is happening in the brain okay the brain operates faster than the rest of the body and uh, yeah you have to go to its memory and heal it change it, what is happening right there is your soul is guiding you to go in uh, the places you have cried in the places you have felt fear in all these places inside your mind mentally you go back into the past and you transmute the energy right there you see the lessons now you have higher awareness now you can see why you why all this had to happen and you transmute that with gratitude with forgiveness by seeing the lesson you let go of the emotional charge and uh, when you let go of the emotional charge there is a, a release in energy there is a liberation you discard not only you change but you discard as well the, the release in the metal body comes in the form of uh, changing the beliefs okay uh, garbaging the thoughts don't, not believing the thoughts it comes in a lot of uh, ways and it happens you know the program of your mind happens faster than um, the change in the cellular cellular memory of the body okay this change on the body is uh, is the one that happens uh, the slowest okay it's the slow the slowest this shift happens you know in slower than everything else on the body so the body can anchor these new energies another thing that is happening uh, in in this moment you feel like set is um, the body is um, and the brain is uh, integrating and forming new pathways to operate on okay you are actually it is changing the mind and the body the body always follows the mind the mind builds new neural pathways based on the new information you are taking based on the new data and it's changing okay it, it is changing based on the environment based on the experience you live the experience you live the new data shapes your mind and your body to that new data and uh, what is happening right there there is our bodies are upgrading and um, learning how to maintain the higher frequency that we tend to fully shift into okay bear in mind that uh, everybody is different okay in my reality my, my, my spiritual awakening has been triggered at 28 years old and everything is happening super fast okay everything is happening super fast here you know it's it happens fast okay and different bodies operate at different speeds and this also depends on the density of the whole energetic system okay of the whole body uh, you, you have to realize it feels so so hard so uncomfortable it feels like you are dying because um, the whole energetic system needs to change to to hold this new frequency permanently this really means you have to rebuild everything and this on the physical plane takes time you'll notice inside yourself that um, the mind is gonna change faster than the rest of the body you will you you will observe observe yourself during this transformation and you'll see that what is happening right there you are receiving upgrades okay dna upgrades lighting codes data uh, you are receiving these things that will move you completely outside of your comfort zone okay and um, you will experience multi-dimensional uh, 
experiences and um, this is gonna be super uncomfortable okay your, your mind you know will begin to 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 dissolve your old ego will begin to dissolve and this is uh, like you are dying you are, you, yeah. the whole part of this uh, rise in consciousness is uh, your old self is dissolving and a new you a new you a new version of you uh, an upgraded version of you builds within based on the guidance of your soul of your intuition of your of the truth of who you are okay and I remember my experience. 11-11-2019. My emotional body experienced unconditional love for its first time. The whole system exploded. It was like I was moving and I was every cell in my body was like ready to explode. It couldn't handle this amount of energy. And my heart said there was I remember going down in bed and I couldn't sleep because all this part here I was ready to explode outside and the, the energy was so strong okay and th that's where I felt uh, unconditional love for the first moment of my life an experience that was higher than any other love I felt in my life The thing you have to, to the thing that is happening there is the that um, the DNA is integrating the new information and uh, it it changes its behavior and form and structure. It's it's like you are shape shifting, okay, and uh, you can experience a lot of physical symptoms. Like you'll see, your body is gonna change if you observe yourself. You might have spine pain, you might have flu symptoms, I don't know, uh, anything, uh, nerves, or uh, migraines, or uh, joint pain, anything, anything. If you become a better observer, you, you will be able, the body speaks, the body speaks, and when you, you are shifting your consciousness, you'll see that uh, the mind is the body and the body is the mind, they, they are interconnected, okay? As the body, so the mind, and as the mind, so the body, you'll see that. You, you'll see that uh, this speaks, this figure. Every cell, every cell in this one communicates with the brain and speaks a language that uh, you can understand. It sends signs always. The body always speaks, and the body always follows the mind. The mind is the master of the body. And uh, yeah, you might uh, you you might experience physical uh, stuff when the whole body is adapting to be able to handle the new frequencies, and that is far from comfortable. Yeah, guys, this is super uncomfortable. And when uh, we are in this transformation period, we experience a lot of chaos. Actually, you might be feeling all all the rage of emotions at the same time <laughs> when i was finding the fear of abandonment when i was removing this uh, limiting belief based on fear inside of my brain this virus th there was at the seventh day that i was a program i was uh, removing the old programming and the program uh, uh, the belief system uh, the, this belief i was feeling Please, I was feeling found, I was feeling whole, I was feeling lost, I was feeling, uh, you know, pain, I was feeling emotional pain, I was, I was feeling the fear of the past, I was, I was feeling love, I was feeling the divine, I was feeling everything, the whole range of emotions, chaos. And this is happening when you are in between the, the two frequency buds, okay, the old and the new, everything is energy and all, although everything is frequency you are in between the two worlds and uh, all this is necessary part of the process okay because 
this is where the reconstruction is happening. This is where um, the, you are reform, you are coming reformed. This is where you um, recalibrate yourself. And uh, until we can be able to hold this new frequency at all times, uh, this is gonna keep coming in waves. And um, you, you, we are gonna experience. I am experiencing a certain time of chaos and overwhelming experiences. You know, it's so super overwhelming. Even the amount of data that is getting inside, you know, it's it's uh, it's opening my brain, and this is uncomfortable. All this pressure is uh, forging the new brain, okay, the new brain pathways, and uh, yeah, yeah. And that is what, what is causing us to feel so uncomfortable and like said, like we are dying actually. And th there is a... Th th this makes even more sense when... Uh, what is happening right there is that we shift our frequencies upwards, okay? We are upgrading and... Uh, This you can uh, you you can take an experiment that it, it is called uh, cymatics and what this experiment does you can Google it at YouTube. Okay, the more you increase the frequency on a metal plate that you have put sold above, the more complex the geometry, the, the more complex the geometry of uh, of the soul structures that, that appear on top of the metal plate uh, are you can check this experiment it, it called uh, you know semantics uh, and this can uh, answer some of the questions of the complexity of the upgrade that is happening within your your cells okay and uh, why it takes time and why it's so uncomfortable okay because there is a change happening in there so this is the video for today. If you like the message, you know, share the video, subscribe to the channel, support the channel. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Peace and glory.